This is Twit. This is a a really interesting hack for the iPhone and iPads, which worked through version 8.1, but inevitably was going to be foreclosed on as soon as Apple realized what was going on. But the fact is, this was hardware. A hardware box costs about 120 pounds, which, which until just November, which is when they went to 8.1.1, was able to, cr to crack four-digit pins. Uh, if you had if you had your iPhone protected by a four-digit pin code, now we've talked about how hard Apple worked to to make that impossible. Specifically, the the famous erase all data after ten attempts lockout. The idea being that you just can't guess four-digit pins day and night yeah. because af after. 10 mistakes it does a it basically remember it throws the keys away it doesn't actually have to wipe the data because the 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 phone is encrypted and all it needs to do is wipe the 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 key which is required to be in line in the hardware that performs the on the fly encryption and decryption as data goes in and out of memory so get a load of this what this hardware does you have to Open the phone up physically, you know, and in fact, there's a picture of it in use on the link above at that, that, that techworm.net uh, link that shows the, the screen popped open. I mean, the, the, the phone guts exposed, which has to happen. Um, then you stick some probes inside. Oh, wow. Now, what this does is, get this, Leo, it tries 0000. zero, zero, zero determines instantly whether it worked or didn't. And if it didn't, it does an instant power cut to the phone. Before, to prevent the deletion. Yeah, to prevent the counting. Ah. So, so Apple made a little mistake, and this is why this is such a perfect example of, you know, like real-world security. Apple's programmers said, okay, so... If it's if they don't enter the pin code correctly, and we ha and erase data after ten attempts is enabled, then we increment a counter which we store in non-volatile memory, so that we're continuing to increment it until they enter it correctly. In which case, we zero the counter. What these guys did was realize they could they could break power, disconnect the battery, so fast after a guess failure that the phone was in the process of recording the guess wow. but wasn't able to complete that update so just a brilliant hack I, I just love this because this is this is the kind of way security breaches occur the, you know where something looks absolutely solid until somebody really motivated looks at the same code everybody else has been looking at and says wait a minute what if we chop the power right here and then reboot the phone and then try the next pin? And if it fails, chop the power, reboot the phone, go again. And it turns out that works. So all Apple had to do is change the sequence. They pre-increment before they do the test so that they've recorded the pending failure in case it does fail rather than post incrementing they did that they changed that in 8.1.1 that's all they had to do to foreclose on this really cool hack but until last november even with the iphone 6 and and version 8 and all of its various incantations uh getting up to up to 8.1.1 you could crack it this way if it was protected by four for a four digit pin wow. if you were using the more complicated passwords there was just you know there, there was no way it was going to guess as it was it could take like 111 hours so many days to go through 0000, 000 to 9999 but if you're you know the law enforcement 
and you needed to get into somebody's phone and it was protected by a four-digit pin, this would do it until a few months ago. So I just love this as a, as a perfect example of, of how clever the hackers can get and how something that looks innocuous can be even further hardened against, you know, this sort of attack. But you'd also have to argue that, boy, it's hard to find all of these. It just takes, you know, it takes bad guys poking at the, at the <clears throat> excuse me, at the, the things that are trying to be secure, acknowledging they're going to find some holes and then plugging them and hoping you don't add new holes as you move forward, which, of course, is always the challenge. 